Two months ago, Brittany and her husband, Terry, had a baby boy. Aww. But three days after being discharged from the hospital, all five of her children were removed from her custody. You see, Terry was allegedly seen punching Brittany's daughter repeatedly. Aww. Terry denied the allegations, but then new information came out that he also abused another one of Brittany's daughters. And there was video to prove it. Take a look. Two months ago, me and my wife had a baby boy. I was taking the kids out to the car after we got done, and some guy was in a, in a car beside of us. And my daughter told me that the guy was recording us. I started freaking out. I started flipping out. You know, I got pissed off because I'm thinking that he's, he's a pervert. I'm thinking that he's recording my kids. I started going off on him, and then I started throwing things in the van. And at the, at the same time, my kids are, are crying. And he videotaped me when I, when I was angry, throwing things around and, and grabbing things. It looked like I was punching my kid in the face. I went back into the building to help my wife with the baby to bring him out to the van. She's asking me what's going on. She heard me out there yelling. And I said, the guy was recording the kids. And I went off. I went, I went berserk. I mean, I, mean I, don't, I don't play that stuff. I backed the van up into a different parking spot so that we wasn't around him so I could just divert the whole situation. And then the police swarmed us. I get out to talk to the police officer and he's like, well, hang on. I'm standing at the front of the cruiser. He goes over to the guy for about five, 10 seconds, looks at the guy's phone, comes straight over to me, slams me on the hood, starts arresting me. No questions asked. And then I found out that I'm being charged with domestic violence and assault on my daughter. The description says that I was beating her in the face repeatedly with my fist. They're also trying to accuse me of hitting another kid. I didn't hit none of them in the face, period. I, that's, I give whoopings, but I don't beat kids in the face. Cops are saying they have video of me beating a child in the face with a closed fist three times. It, it's ruined my life, you know what I mean? It's got people second guessing me. My wife, Brittany, don't want me back at the house until I can clear my name. They also took our kids away. It just, it's, it's, it's rough. I knew they didn't get to spend the first day with him coming home. What do you want to say to Brittany? You need to know that I'm telling the truth, that I didn't do nothing wrong. I love you, and I, I'll do anything I can for you to get your kids back. I'm ready to show that I'm not the monster that they make me out to be. Uh, Brittany, that's your husband on the tape. Uh, why are you here? Uh, I want to know if he punched my kids in the face. I want answers. You're not sure if he did or not? Uh, I, I believe he did. Yeah, you believe he did. Um, how long have you and Terry been together? Six years, married five. Six years, married five. Um, and tell me about the day that led to your, because your, ch your children were taken away. Mm -hmm. When did this incident happen, by the way? About two months ago. Two months ago. Um, and, and now they took all your kids? All five of them, yep. Even the newborn? Even my newborn. Well, that's, that, and that's really tough because you really want to bond with the newborn, right? Yep, I had one week with him. Um, when, when you, because you came out of the hospital and the police were locking him up. Yeah. Um, I want to answer I wanted to know what was going on. I was confused. I didn't know about a video being present until after they removed my kids and showed me a video. Yeah. And when you saw that video, what, what, what did you see on it? I seen what they, were, what they were accusing him of. That he was hitting the kids. I didn't even want to finish watching it. I was hurt. Disturbing, right? Yes, very. What yeah. do you have to do to get your kids back? Uh, I'm doing everything right now on the right steps to get my kids back. I mean, what have they told you you have to do? Uh, I do random day, day scrubs, uh, drug screens every day. Every day I call in downtown to make sure I do dr drug screen. If I have to go, I got to drop everything I'm doing and go right then and there. Uh, I'm in three different support parenting group classes. Uh, I have to I had to attend a drug assessment test. Uh, counseling, I go to doctors once a week. It's a lot, a lot. And do you have any idea when you possibly could get your kids back? Um, they try to tell me March 16th, but I'm trying to fight an emotion to get my kids home sooner, and that's why maybe this will help me get my kids home sooner. And, uh, I mean, how does, how does it feel not having your kids? It hurts. Yeah. Really bad. Mm -hmm. The one guy's videotaping saying, yeah. I'm thinking this guy's hitting his kids, and then another guy 
who doesn't even know the guy videotaped and saying, yeah, I saw this guy hitting his kid. This is my first time of the, hearing about yeah. the second videotape, but... Not second videotape. This is just an independent witness saying... That's the first time I heard so that. So two different people. That's the first, That's time, first I time I heard that, that, too. Okay, well, explain it. How two people that don't even know each other saying, you're hitting the kids. It. I can't explain it. Because maybe they saw you doing it. No. Okay. Uh, what do you have to do to get your kids back? Well, uh, I mean, they, they want me to take domestic violence classes. And you're charged with domestic violence, so you have to go to court. Yeah, tomorrow. And you, uh, you might end up going to jail for this. Yeah. Hmm. Are you worried? Nope. You're not worried? No. You're not worried? Not one bit. Oh, it's nice. <laughs> I'd be worried. I'd be <laughs> brick. That's a that's a pretty. What's that? That's, that's hard to squeeze out a brick. <laughs> so is going to jail for hitting your kids. Yeah. Yeah. That's gonna be really hard. Yeah. If it happens, you know. Uh, did you strike any of the children in the face that day? When you were in Britney's van, you answered no. You told the truth. Other than the seven-year-old and the 10-year-old, did you strike any other children in Britney's van that day? You answered no. You did not tell the truth. Oh. Have you ever struck? Who else did you whoop in the van? My two-year-old? No. I, I didn't strike no other kids. Well, you failed for that. Well, that's. Oh, but how about the first one? Did you strike any of the kids in the face? I mean, that's you what I told you one. in the first place. I but I'm saying you passed that face. one. Yeah. You like that one? No, of course. But you don't like the second one. <laughs> Read it again. Other than the seven-year-old and the ten-year-old, did you strike any of the other children in Britney's van that day? You answered no, and it says you did not tell the truth. You don't like that one. Eh, you know, one out of two is not bad, that's right? A show. It is a TV show, yeah. but it also exposes people. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> Have you ever struck any of the children leaving marks or bruises? He answered, yes. Oh, wow. Never said yes to nothing. <laughs> you guys are full. Oh. This show is a lie. Okay. Yeah, you're full. Full. You're going yes to, to tomorrow for I hitting said your kids. Yes to you are charged with domestic violence against your yep. own children. Yeah. Well. Some of her children and some of yours. Not all. Yeah. And you got all her kids taken away. Yeah. Newborn baby who needs to bond with their mother, maybe even being breastfed, is taken away and with strangers because you can't control yourself. You get carried away. Thank God, by the grace of, you know, we, we get on people for not doing enough today in society that watch things, that just videotape. But at least these people did something videotape and got your ass locked up. Well, tomorrow's your court date, and I hope you're convicted of all the crimes you're accused of, and you're a big piece of and you can get a hell off my stage. The good thing is, with this case, there's video evidence, and when he's in court tomorrow, everybody's gonna get to see what, um, what he did. I mean, this is a guy who loses his temper with little kids. I mean, and he not only, I mean, he's hitting all the kids in the car. Can you imagine a two, three-year-old, this guy's losing his, uh, his temper? He was literally only out in the van with him for a full three but minutes. How bad was it that a stranger starts videotaping video it? Got it within three minutes, yes. Right. And then, like I said, I don't, I don't know if you even read the case file, but there is another independent witness saying... I saw it too. I read it, but I didn't even pay attention to yeah. that. So there's, there's two people that are walking through this parking lot seeing this lunatic beating up a bunch of little kids. So um, I certainly hope that... I had to know some part of it was true. Yeah. I mean, I seen it, and I couldn't even finish watching it. So. Well, I'm proud of you for getting away from this guy. Mm -hmm. and, uh, <laughs> and, you know, you're doing the steps, and I hope you get your kids back soon. Um, yeah, I love my baby kids, more than anything in the world. Kids need their mothers. Hopefully, you get to stay away from this guy and he stays. Oh, away it's going to happen if my babies are coming home, so he can't be around. So. Good luck to you. Thank you. <laughs> 
Thank you to all of our fans for helping us reach 1 million subscribers. Now let's get 1 million more. Make sure to subscribe now.